Hello, I wanted to talk seriously and honestly for a moment about my thoughts on what's been going on for the past couple months and hopefully you, you can get a better understanding of my perspective. I think it's time to end the subscribe to PewDiePie movement or meme. It's something that started off as a way to keep me as the number one most subscribed channel on YouTube and seeing so many people come to my support, other creators as well, uh, has been incredibly humbling to me. It's really, really meant a lot. It's something I never thought I would experience. And it's something I thought would last also for maybe just a couple of days or maybe a week. But here we are. It's been six to seven months now and it's been a crazy journey. At first, it started off with people doing really positive and fun things to get attention through subscribe to PewDiePie. But something I learned and I think hopefully it's something people can understand is when you have 90 million people riled up about something, you're bound to get a few degenerates. And it started off with someone spray painting sub to PewDiePie on a World War II memorial and just so disgusting. So disappointing to have my name and community uh, dragged into that. I uh, addressed it on Twitter. I disavowed it. We saw that it got removed and and donated to the park. Hope that that was going to be it. I didn't want hateful acts to overpower all these amazing things that people were doing, all these cool and positive things. But then something happened that I don't think anyone would have predicted. The Christchurch shooter said subscribe to PewDiePie. Out of the, re the respect for the families and victims involved, I chose not to address it any further than on Twitter, where I disavowed the actions taken that day and I gave my sincerest condolences to everyone affected. To have my name associated to with something so unspeakably vile has affected me in more ways than I let shown. I just didn't want to address it right away and I didn't want to give the terrorists any more attention. I didn't want to make it about me because I, I don't think it has anything to do with me. To put it plainly, I didn't want hate to win, but it's clear to me now the sub subscribe to PewDiePie movement should have ended then. Lastly, my feelings around the subscribe to PewDiePie thing would not be complete without mentioning T-Series. Uh, I made two diss tracks that were made in fun, ironic jests. They were not meant to be taken seriously. And now High Court in India demands that they're going to be blocked and removed. This was all made to be fun, but it's clearly not fun anymore. It's clearly gone too far. And out of respect for that, I'm gonna keep the videos blocked. On a similar note, some people and some media has made this sub to PewDiePie thing about race or about politics or nationality. And I don't agree with that at all. And I want that to stop. This negative rhetoric is something I don't agree with at all. And I want that to stop and to make it perfectly clear. No, I'm not racist. I don't support any form of racist comments or hate towards anyone. Finally, I don't want hitting 100 million subscribers to be about beating another channel. I think what we've accomplished is so much more than that. And I just want to say I feel incredibly lucky to have such an amazing group of people supporting me. I think I can say that because I know them better than anyone. I, unironically, I'm so proud of this community. And this movement started out of love and support, so let's end it with that. I hope that you understand my perspective, and I ask you kindly to accept it. Thank you for listening. That's all. Bye.